fabric is such a really evocative medium to start with because of all of the feelings that people have about fabric. It's like your mom or a couch that you remember from when you were a kid. It's sentimental sort of in and of itself. My mom, she sewed a lot of my clothes and I remember her sewing my dad a suit. And so it's in my DNA. My name's Caitlin Carey and uh, I'm a textile artist. I make needle prints full of people and the significant buildings that make Raleigh feel like my home. So very often in my work, I'm depicting a, a specific place. I drive around and take photographs and also figuring out how it translates into fabric. That's been a training of my own mind. It's neat. When I look at a photograph, I, I immediately start breaking it down into pieces. That photograph gets blown up to size and I make a map out of it. From those isolated elements, I go into my world of fabric and then sew each element down on the sewing machine. I do my own framing and my own mounting, so I'm in charge of the process from start to finish, which, which feels really neat. I've always had very busy hands. For many years, I was a, a musician, a songwriter, and play violin, and all of it is storytelling. All of it is creating a narrative out of nothing into something. I'm currently working on a commission piece of Yates Mill, an old mill that is now a park, and I'm thinking of a way to make the water kind of magical in this piece. It's juxtaposed with some kind of heavy, um, dark fabrics for the wood of the mill. It feels good to be one small part of a big project of documenting things before they're gone. And there's been all this change, you know, in recent years of lots of development and things that were iconic to Raleigh have been getting torn down. So a big part of the impetus for the start of my work was to document buildings in Raleigh that made Raleigh feel like Raleigh. That has really struck a chord with other people too, that we really value the little humble businesses and the little humble buildings that make it feel like home.